It's always been important to check in on our senior citizens to make sure they have what they need. But what happens when those needs suddenly change because of a pandemic? In today's Acts of Kindness report, Steve Gargiola catches up with a group now delivering something different to keep seniors safe and healthy. The Area Agency on Aging sounds very official, but if you break it down to its simplest idea, it's a group of good people taking care of the most vulnerable people in our community. One of our biggest goals is to keep seniors safe in their homes as long as they're, it's possible and as long as they're comfortable. Most seniors want independence, but it's hard, especially for someone who is home alone. I would say that the trend is that, you know, that older adults want to remain in their homes uh, and independent as long as they can. That's one of the things that I think this, this pandemic has, has really shown us is that, you know, the nursing homes are very vulnerable. The Area Agency on Aging, 1B, covers most of our area. Recently, they directed a project to get sanitizer and protective equipment to seniors and their caretakers. Our first large donation was from um, Oakland County, actually, and they gave us 10,000 disposable masks to provide, um, which was incredible. The more recent project delivers food to homebound seniors. We distributed 2,250 boxes, and right now we're on our second round of 4,700 boxes. And this is not a box lunch we're talking about. So each box is 26 pounds and it holds 22 to 23 meals within it. The essential food to keep seniors safe and well fed in their home so they don't have to go to the grocery store and pick up those items. All of the food and supplies are a result of donations. And I will tell you, Steve, that the Metro Detroit community in particular is so open hearted and generous in times of crisis. It's just been a very humbling and beautiful thing to watch. The kind of generosity we continue to see across our communities pretty much every day. I'm Steve Garagiola, Local 4.